All right, so we're going to take a look at the flat file. It's just a text file. You can see that I have name, ID, session number, scheduled date and time procedure code, all just test data. So it's just a text file. And we're going to open up SQL Server 2000. Um, go to the databases. I have a database called Test Database. Right click on that. We'll expand it. Then right click on it. And we're going to go to All Task, Import Data. The wizard will pop up. Go to next. Source data is first, so we'll select uh, text file. We'll then brow browse for it on our PC. We find our flat file.txt. Select it and open it up. Then we go next, and it, it's going to ask to look for our uh, the format of the file. So see it, it uh, sees it. We say it's a delimited. The first row has our column name, so we'll check that. It's a pipe delimited text file. Uh, it recognizes the pipes right away, and we can see that it uh, sorts the data, parses it correctly. So we'll go next. And then it's going to ask for the destination of the text file. We're going to go to the test database. Uh, it's going to, by default, give a create a table with the name of the text file. We're just going to change that just to show you that you can it can be changed, and we'll call it uh, import table. If you go into the transform and click over there, you can see that it finds the source uh, column names and gives it to the destination. We can do a preview here. So that's what our table will look like. Say OK. Then we'll click Next. It's going to say, do you want to run immediately? We'll say OK. Say Next. And we'll click Finish. And now it's going to finish imports the table, one table copied into. You can see four records were imported. And we'll hit Done. Uh, then we're going to go on to Quer SQL Query Analyzer from the Tools menu into this uh, database. On the left side, we can select the database, expand it, user tables, and you'll see it created an import table. We'll just do a simple select star from import table. Uh, execute that with the execution button at the top, and you see there's our four rows.